This video is made possible by Skillshare. Sign up using the link in description and get 2 months of Skillshare Premium and access to 22,000 classes. We humans, being a couple of feet high, weighing barely a quintal, are capable of making and building things million times bigger and heavier than us. And we have proved it. While our technical instruments and communication devices keep getting smaller, our machines keep getting bigger. If this is your first time over here and want to know amazing stuff, make sure you hit the subscribe button and the bell so you won't miss any updates. It was designed and operated by French performance art company La Machines. The spider was showcased in Liverpool, England as part of the 2008 European Capital of Culture celebrations. Weighing in at 37 tons, she stands 50 feet high and has 50 hydraulic axes of moment. It takes 12 people to operate her. In order to transport her from one place to another, she requires 16 cranes, 8 cherry pickers and 250 crew members. It is manufactured by Bellas in Belarus. The entire truck cost over $6 million. The hybrid diesel Bellas was built for one thing, moving earth. Its two 16 cylinders gives it 13,738 pounds of torque, more than the combined power of 17 heavy-duty pickup trucks. The company claims a full-loaded Bellas can lunge around 450 tons of dirt at 25 miles per hour. At 800,000 pounds, the Bellas isn't heavy, just big boned. The Antof AH 225 Miria is a cargo aircraft that was designed by the Soviet Union. It is powered by six turbofan engines and is the longest and the heaviest airplane ever built with a maximum takeoff weight of 640 tons. The Antof AN 225 was initially developed for transporting the Buran Space Shuttle. Squiver Gustav is the biggest railgun ever made. It was developed in late 1930s by German dynasty to destroy the main forts of French Magnot Line. The fully assembled gun weighed nearly 1350 tons and could fire shells weighing 7 tons to a range of 47 kilometers. Crawler is a vehicle used by NASA to transport rockets and space shuttle. These enormous 40 meter long, 35 meters wide machines weigh in at around 2720 tons. The crawler transporter is the largest self-powered land vehicle in the world. Bertha is a tunnel boring machine built specifically for the Alaskan Way Viaduct Replacement Tunnel Project in Seattle. Bertha is the world's biggest tunnel boring machine. She drops any of her competitors with a total length of 300 feet. She is a massive 7000 ton machine that needs to be shipped between work sites. Built by Samsung Heavy Industries, the OOCL Hong Kong is the biggest cargo ship ever built. It has carrying capacity of 21,413 TEUs, being the first one to cross the 21,000 mark. The first cargo ship is powered by the biggest IC engines, generating more than 80,000 kW of power. Bagger 288 is built by German company Krupp, is a bucket wheel excavator or mobile strip mining machine. It can excavate 2400,000 tons of coal of overburden daily. The bagger's operation requires 16.56 megawatt of externally supplied electricity. It can travel up to 10 meters per minute. The whole thing stands at 96 meter tall and is 225 meters long. The largest machine in the world was created to study the tiniest composition known, the structure of atomic nucleus. Nuclear accelerators are nothing new. They were first invented in 1930s for investigating the many aspects of particle physics. The Hadron Collider is 17 miles in circumference and is buried 574 feet under the ground near Geneva in Switzerland. Inside the collider, two high energy beams are shot at each other, traveling at close to the speed of light. They are guided by thousands of superconducting magnets inside two ultra high vacuum tubes. Alright guys, thanks for watching 
Stay tuned for more videos and I will see you in the next one.